step up and have that kind of offensive performance. And that streaking rack attack is the mobile one drive. Yeah, taking the onus on himself to make something happen. Got it into the teeth of the defense and made them pay. Baseline jumper. Plumley pulls down the board. And now just over a minute played here in the first. Westbrook drives. Pass to Plumley. Out to Leonard. Now here's George. Yes! And it's left good. George has got five now. Man, they're making everything and look confident. Five shots, five makes. Vassell against George. Vassell can't get it to go. For Los Angeles, they've gone five of five in this quarter. Solid. Westbrook, the pass to Plumley. George outside. Leonard on the wing. Clippers hit again from the inside tonight, just getting down into the painted area and just dominating, controlling that spot. A line change here for San Antonio. Payne with it, guarded now by George. Let's it go. Again, the miss by the Spurs. Johnson was part of that U.S. team that played in 2021. Yeah, what a great experience, Greg. Oh, B.A., I mean, I can speak in great detail how much you can gain playing. Pass to Bullock. Here's Bassey. Now Collins. He's checked by Plumley. Four on the clock. Jacks up a three. Tries to save it. Well, there's the shot clock violation. So they'll turn it over. And you got to be in awe of incredible defensive efforts like this. Yeah, what a play. I mean, that'll have the offense thinking twice about taking shots in his presence. He just scores in a myriad of ways. He's hitting threes, he's driving, he's dunking, he's making plays. PG, the complete package. George drives in, and there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. And with his pause, a check on the stats to show you which teams led the league in assists last year. San Antonio in second. And if you have to ask, what's the name of the game? Well, it's all about ball movement for them. They love to share the rock. And we all know that assists are... Up and in on the layup. Leonard's got four points now in the quarter. He's got a lot to do with the position that they're in a very smart offensive performance tonight from him. Now Johnson from outside the arc. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. Leonard's got four rebounds now. Morris passes to George. Three-pointer. That one's good from Morris on the assist by George. Down to five on the shot clock. Spurs need to get one up here. Well, the grimace of pain tells it all. He's hurt. Let's hope he's okay. Uh, and hopefully it's not as bad as it looks. That would be a big blow for them. Well, looking at his face right there, you can tell he's in a lot of pain, and there's a lot of trepidation right now on that team's sideline. And the Spurs making a change here. Graham's checked in. Guys, I got some news from the Spurs head athletic trainer. Apparently, that knee was twisted pretty severely. No torn ligaments, but still significant pain and swelling. There will be no return to the floor tonight, and it sounds like recovery period is going to last a little longer than they were hoping for. Guys? All right, that's good intel. We've definitely been thinking of him, and now we have some more clarity, guys. Yeah, they now have all the information they need in order to determine the next steps. Everybody wishing the best for him. We all know how badly guys are putting in the work inside. Westbrook, the pass to Plumley. Oh, and a fast break for the Spurs. Here's Sohan for three. Nails it from three. He's got five. And taking a quick look here at the hustle stats for the Spurs. Well, their D has been a major story tonight. I mean, those steals and putting pressure on the ball, clogging the passing lanes, and making smart adjustments, setting guys up for success. The possession's just way more efficient, I think, here tonight, taking smarter, better shots, moving the ball around. That's helped them get back in the ball game. Heady play to stop that easy layup right there. I mean, make him earn it at the line. At the line for the Clippers. And he drops the first. Paul George, really a true two-way player in the NBA. He gives you so much 
on both. Got to be careful about being too aggressive on him and sending him back for freebies. Outside Graham. Collins a screen. Shoots from 12. Here's Bassey. They shoot again. And even after two offensive rebounds, they just can't take the lid off. Westbrook, the pass to George. And that one comes off the assist by Westbrook. And here's George. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. That straight line drive there from Paul George. You love to see him get in that attack mode. Let's we'll see if he can cash in now at the line. Vassell, he's checked in for San Antonio. George hits them both. All around. That has to change right now. And Allie, thank you for that. Nails it from beyond the arc. One this half, two for the game. Staying active from beyond the arc. Humley a screen on Vassell. Here's George. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Again, when you go from second to fourth gear, Paul George puts a lot of pressure on the defense that way. Well, Brent, as someone who played for Greg Popovich, San Antonio has gone one of two from deep in this quarter. George against Vassell. Let's it go from 11. And there's the rejection. It's George on the drive, and he gets that one. What great body control there. George, tremendous athlete, takes the hit, and he makes that one count. Shooting for LA. That's good from George. Boy, you love how guys are making plays for one another here. Yeah, just a balanced attack, a total team effort. Here's Wimbanyama. He's guarded by Zubats. Pass to Johnson. Just five on the clock. Denied by Leonard. And that's what you expect from one of the greatest defenders maybe this league has ever seen. Great play by Kawhi that time. Good effort from the squad. Time called here. San Antonio decides to talk it over. There's a minute 54 left in the final quarter. The Clippers have gotten five shots out of nine to go in this fourth. Pass to Covington. Takes a three. Knocks down the long J. Balance perimeter when he needs it. Now here's Booker. 33 points last game. In the corner, it's Gordon. Phoenix, no good that time either. Just haven't found their offensive footing yet, only managing to sink one of their first five shots. Here's Beal. Oh, and the dunk by Beal. And maybe not the most explosive player in the league, but Beal has the athletic ability to finish strong at the rim. If you're just tuning in, we... Henderson passes to Grant. Back to Henderson. Good, and Grant hits the assist. And their post play has been really solid right off the bat. And so it's Durant with it. He'll bring it up for the Phoenix Suns. Trailing by two. Booker in the corner. Nurkic setting the pick for Booker. Gets it from three-point range. It just seems, Richard, like Robert Williams is a guy willing to do anything to help his team. And there's a whole lot he can do. His defense has never been a question. He can dish it. He's an aggressive rebounder. And look, his effort level, that's something you don't have a question. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. G.A., he's asked to carry a big-time scoring load, but Bradley Beal makes his teammates better as well. And that's an area, Kevin, he has really grown in his play. No good from Grant. The Suns leading. Well, a chance to check out some stats for Kevin Durant. Phoenix shooting their third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Bradley Beal taking two shots. The first one falls. And quite simply, 
Beal is an all-NBA player in our league. A multi-dimensional. The squads with the most assists in the NBA. Fourth, the Suns. It was true team basketball we saw out of them. Always willing to work together. No one making himself bigger than the team. Two minutes now played in the second quarter. Williams finds Thibel. Just five to shoot. Simons from outside. And the rebound by Norkic. Norkic has got his seventh rebound here tonight. Good one. Passes to Book. Good on the three-point shot. Last three-point. Brand sets a screen for Henderson. Back to Thibel. Portland needs to get off the shot. Henderson, no good. And he's been way off the mark this quarter. It's been ugly. To the left wing. Here's Goodwin. Trains the three-pointer. Goodwin's got Fonz. Has it in the corner. And a miss there on the triple. Another rebound hauled in. They're hitting the glass with a lot of passion. And check out numbers for Kevin Durant. Last season, he played outstanding. Last season, put up about 30 points a game. Six assists and seven rebounds. And when they need to add defense, that's who they look to. It's hard to find defensive spark plugs, but he is one of them. The whole team comes alive on D when he's in the game. He is one of them. The whole team comes alive on D when he's in the game. And both free throws good for Beal. By the looks of it, the Hall of Fame class of 2023, Richard, should be loaded. A lot of big names could be headed to Springfield, Massachusetts. Yeah, it's going to be beautiful to see two of the biggest rivalries, San Antonio and Dallas. Tony Parker and Dirk Nowitzki are on the pad. And then there's Mr. Wade, Dwayne Wade. We know about that. So there's going to be a lot of rings walking into that ceremony. Here's KD. And at last, they get one to fall. And this has been a great job of just getting into the middle of that defense and really scoring effectively from the paint. To halt the run. Great D that time from Durant. Suns leading by 13. On the wing, Booker. Nurkic a screen on Simon. Drills the three-pointer. Booker's got 12. See if they were listening, guys. All right, David, thanks. Down low and stolen by Williams. To the inside. And then Sharp with the dunk. Incredible reverse throwdown. Excellent body control. And guys, I'd even go as far to say that was a punctuation dunk. And it's Beal in the corner. Bangs home the trifecta. That's money from Beal. He's so crafty at finding space in that deep corner. Grant sets a screen for Henderson. Grant outside. Trying to answer back, but that three is off the mark. And physically, there's no doubt they've been the stronger team. A plus 10 rebound advantage tells you all you need to know. Okay, KD for a little extra on that one. And on the AT&T 5G slam cam, you... And the three off target. You know what? He's got to look to get other guys involved. The three-point stroke is off. Offensive rebound, Grant. Great D that time from Nurkic. Gordon finds Durant. Back to Gordon. Fires the three. Buries the long-range jumper. Gordon's got... On the wing, Booker. KD on the wing. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Third personal foul. We've seen some kids go directly from high school, RJ, to the G League. How do you think that's working out so far? Green and Kaminga sure look good. And look, I think for a small select group of individuals, they should go and start working on their... Almost drop. Here's Beal. Tries again. Rebound by the Trailblazers. 56 seconds left in the fourth. Simons from outside. That shot off the mark. And Phoenix the other way now. Looking to end his cold spell. And the dunk by Booker. And you can sense that these fans 
These players, they are these players, they are ready to celebrate. It's always nice to perform like this, especially in front of the faithful home crowd. Beal with the steal. Hooker against Simon. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. And Booker is so active on offense, which really forces the D to help with aggression at times. Devin Booker at the line for That one falls, so he hits both early on, and they're being rewarded for their efforts. And the ability of Beal to just wear out the defense, at times you almost have to foul him to stop him. Bradley Beal, two shots. Free throw good, Beal. He hits both from the strut.